Hello and welcome! In this video, I'll be going over my recent pickups from the end of May and start of June 2019. Um, most of the things have been purchased from EB Games Australia as part of their mid-year sale. Um, massive sale, massive discounts, and a massive hit to my bank account. Um, I'm not even really sure where to start with this giant mountain. However, I will just quickly note, as my regular viewers may have noticed, the amiibo wall is gone. I have packed it up, ready to move, um, and this will all be getting packed up once I finish this video. Uh, let's just start down the bottom and get right into it, because we have multiple layers to get through. First up, they had a lot of plushes go half price. So here we have a Bowser. Um, it was originally... Uh, uh, terrible, sorry about that. Uh, it was originally $55, so down to, let's see, 25, 26, 7 and a half, 27 and a half roughly, uh, if my math worked out well. Um, there was a Donkey Kong one as well, also half price. I'm guessing probably also close to similar price range, maybe 40 down to 20, something like that. Same with Diddy Kong, these ones weren't stickered. Um, well, they were stickered and I pulled them off, I don't remember. Um, I like the Donkey Kong series, so that's why I grabbed those. Um, a warp pipe down from 15 to 750. Um, some charging things that were getting thrown out. So, mine, they're car sockets. Um, yes, yeah, so there's the warp pipe. You can stick stuff into it. Then a piranha plant in a warp um, pipe plush as well. Uh, so 28 down to 14. Um, coming along the front, we have some books, essentially. So we have a notepad down from $10 to $4. Um, Assassin's Creed Gauntlet something something. You make a wooden thing. I thought it was cool. Um, $15 down to 9 A Game Gear notepad. This was probably down to 9 or 4 Something like that. No, that one was down to 5 um, A Mega Drive console down to 9 A $20 canvas down to 4 um, Lots of things. The main price point seemed to be $4, $9, and then half price. Um, I also got a steel case for Crash Bandicoot the Insane Trilogy. Um, moving up. <laughs> As some of my viewers may have seen, I recently had my Sale um, Eau de Toilette perfume from EB Games come in. Um, so that's there. Two Kingdom Hearts keyring pops, um, usually ten dollars each. Now down to four. Shadow Heartless and Sora. Um, while we're on that, we have Mysterion South Park, also down from ten to four. Let's move those out of the way. We have the World of Nintendo Splatoon weird squishy thing. So blue, green, orange, and pink. That's the full collection. There. Yeah. Um, I think they were ten dollars down to two or four, something like that. I thought they were finally. I managed to find all of them, so I bought them all. Um, Detective Pikachu figures. I managed to find the entire set, so I bought them fifteen dollars each from uh, some from EB Games slash Zing and some from Mr. Toys Toy World because I couldn't find them all at the one place. I'll move those to the side. Um, a uh, Hitman 2 rubber ducky. Um, EB Games got some in and it, it was a matter of buying any Hitman product and get it for free. Um, what fell? Let's see. We have a um, Game Boy Classic watch. Uh, this one, I believe, was half price. I took the half price sticker off already by the looks of it while trying to figure out how to set the watch. I'll do that eventually. Move that out of the way. What else fell? We have a um, 2600 Atari joystick. Um, this was down from $12 to $4. And 
that's the same deal with the actual console itself. So some cool little key rings there. Sticking with key rings, we have a Pokemon Psyduck key ring down to two dollars. And we also had everything's gonna fall. A Master Ball key ring, four dollars. Don't remember what the original price was, but being Pokemon, it wouldn't have been cheap. Um, four different Kingdom Hearts 3 pens. Uh, they were originally $10 each, now they're down to that, ah, dropping things, $4 each. So I bought each one that was available. Uh, Mario Sports Superstar Amiibo Cards Blind Packet. Down from $4 to $1. Unfortunately, I only managed to find one of them. I wish I could find more to ensure I can finish my collection, but that's all good. Um, we have a three bracelet set from The Legend of Zelda, $20 down to $9. There goes some more stuff. Uh, we have Mario um, stud earrings, half price. Let's get the things that fell. I have from Limited Run Games some Jack and Daxter slash Jack 2, Jack 3 um, collectibles. So there was a shirt, as well as physical releases from uh, Limited Run Games. These are PlayStation 2 games by Naughty Dog, re-released onto the PlayStation 4. I uh, also have collector's editions in the mail. I pre-ordered them like end of last year, waiting for them to come. Uh, disc is currently out, and in the PlayStation, I did a live stream of it the other day. Um, and then once I play through that, I will be playing through Jack 3 and then Jack X when it comes as well. So, that's that. Okay. Next row. We have an Alexios... Assassin's Creed statue, half price, down from $90. We have a Legend of Zelda um, tumbler with straw, down to $4. As well as a Super Mario Land Game Boy uh, metal drink thing, down to $4. There's going to be lots of things down to $4. Um, I got a Clyde Destiny... Um, pre-order bonus statue thing that was left over at one of the stores, uh, so cool. Um, Super Mario Maker glass bottle down to nine dollars. Legend of Zelda steel um, bottle down to nine dollars. Oops, that was loud. Legend of Zelda thermos bottle thing down to four dollars we have two classic drink canteens down from eighteen dollars to nine dollars um, super mario bros and the legend of zelda um, before i get into all the mugs let's move to the side here so we have a z crystal set from ten dollars down to four as well as the New um, Z Ring accessory version two, half price, so down to eleven fifty if I'm doing my math well. <laughs> and then a bunch of games and things. So we have a Disney Infinity playset piece. We bought three place uh, Nintendo Switch games. These were all half price each. This one came from our back, so it didn't actually have a sticker on it. So half price, half price, and half price. Uh, good little things to add to the collection. Um, PlayStation 3, Tekken Tag Tournament 2, Steelcase <laughs> Edition, Grand Kingdom, uh, bonus art book and soundtrack, so this is just the art book and soundtrack, uh, without the game, same here, Steelcase, so it's just the Steelcase and Division things, not the actual game. Yeah. Halo 2 on the Xbox, Eternal Sonata on the Xbox 360, so these games that were priced as 
uh, $18 and under, it was 3 for 18 so that one was included for that. The next one wasn't. Catherine, uh, Catherine um, on the 360 down from $28 to 23 uh, This was part of the uh, 3 for 18 deal, so we have planes on the Wii U, we have Fast Racing Neo on the Wii U, as well as Creed, the Prehistoric Party, then we have Knight's Journey of Dreams, we have LEDs, this one was just 4 bucks. Monster Truck Arenas, Kart Racer, EA Playground, Ultimate Red Bull Challenge, Guitar Hero Aerosmith, Truth or Lies, F1 2019, Tetris Party, Crash Car Racer, Big Beach Sports 2, and then I bought a uh, PC game. Uh, it was like down to four dollars, I believe. So there's eight simulation games on it. I bought it essentially. Uh, excuse me. Essentially for the zoo park and the farming world. Um, and you know we'll see how everything goes. Um, also then we have seen it. Xbox 360. Cool. That is that row done. We can move on to the next one. Second last one. Okay. Um, I've shown you the Alexia statue, so let's move that out of the way, as I damaged the box a little. Um, Assassin's Creed Odyssey wrist strap thing, that was probably half price. Uh, this one was definitely half price, so for $15, the limited edition wrist band. Um, half price inflatable PlayStation chair. And a bunch of mugs, so we have the uh, like Valentine's Day mug that was released last year down to nine dollars. There's two mugs inside it. Then we have I'm gonna make some room for all this stuff. Okay, going from the top, we have an Eevee mug for nine dollars, another Eevee mug for nine dollars. We have a Zelda heat change mug for nine dollars. We have a Crash Bandicoot heat change mug. I, I believe it's a heat change. Hang on, is this a heat change? The um, no, just a plain Aku Aku, um, pattern one. Uh, we have a Minecraft TNT mug for $9. We have a half-price Spyro molded mug. We have a $4 heat-changing, uh, South Park the Fractured Butthole knife, uh, mug. We have a half-price Pikachu mug. How much was this originally? It was 15 We have a... Sun and Moon Starter Mug for $4. We have a Legend of Zelda Mug for $4. And we have two Super Nintendo Mugs for $4. I bought a lot of mugs this month. <laughs> um, we have a Boo Coffee Mug and a Donkey Kong Barrel Coffee Mug down from $20 to $9. We have a Tomb Raider Mug that was half price, I believe. And we have a... Legend of Zelda Link mug, uh, nine dollars down from eighteen. Okay, final stretch. Bear with me. Time to move on to the pop vinyls. So, I managed to get a whole lot of pre-owned ones from my local store, as well as some new releases. Um, so, working our way from the top to the bottom, we have the Bulbasaur and the Charmander. You would have seen maybe. If you're subscribed to my channel, unboxings for those two. I picked up a Seated Sally Nightmare Before Christmas pop off of Facebook Marketplace. I pre-ordered the Bugs Bunny Flocked Special Edition pop. I bought for, as part of the mid-year sale some pops that have been reduced to $9 each. Bought two of the Soldier Heartless so I can... Have like a whole swarm of them coming after the pops. Okay, moving these out of the way. Having a clear wall makes things easier. We have a Gamer Mickey pop. We have a Gamer Mini pop. All of those went down from $18 to $9. Um, we have some Pixel Pals here that were reduced to $4 each, so I bought those two Mega Man ones. 
Um, any other new ones there? No, they are all the pre-owned. And okay, so all of the pre-owned ones were twelve dollars each. Um, but I got them as part of buy two get one free. Um, I believe now they are, however, just half price. Um, so we have Princess Leia and R two D two. We have some of the ride ones. Uh, we have Star Wars Collector's Edition one, quite awesome. We have two Game of Thrones ones. We have an Aladdin First Wish. We have a Labyrinth 6 inch. And then we have, like, I believe all the other Labyrinth ones. So we have Hoggle, <laughs> Jareth, Jareth again. The Jareth down the bottom there as well. Sarah and Worm. And I think, is there one more? No, that's all of them. Okay. We have a Baby Pegasus. We have an Obi Wan Kenobi. We have a BB 8. We have Tigger, we have Poo, we have Poo again, and we have Eeyore. We have a Chase Porg, we have a Nibbler, we have a Deadpool the Dark. We have Castile, Dean, and Sam. We have a Heffalump, and Deadpool, and Darth Maul. And that is not the end. I just saw some more things hiding in a corner. <laughs> Almost forgot these. Okay. Um, I think that's everything. Okay, there were some hats that I bought as well, down to, I think, $9. As well as part of the buy three for 18 we have Glee Karaoke, we have Spider-Man 3, that one was just $4. And then we had Cricket, which was have been part of the buy three, get one free. And then we had this amazing deal, we had Monster Hunter Generations go down from $60 to $4. My store had six, um... I went and I bought it, one of my friends bought one, one random customer bought one, I turned my back and then the other three had sold as well. Amazing deal. Um, it was essentially a clearance item, try and get rid of it. I think EB might be sold out now. Um, if you are looking for the game, <laughs> good luck. Um, jump online, see if you can find it. Um, okay, I am out of breath. That was quite a lot to get through. Let me know if you remembered them all, which was your favorite item. Um, did you pick up anything as part of the EB Games uh, mid-year sale? Let me know in the comments section below. Like the video if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. I do unboxing, shopping hauls, and video gameplay quite often. Um, other than that, like, share, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, thanks for watching, and goodbye.